Israel carried out an attack on the key Syrian port of Latakia last Friday, according to statements made by three anonymous U.S. officials. The pre-dawn blast allegedly targeted a Russian-made anti-ship missile battery, which Syria received two years ago. Latakia is around 80 kilometers from Russia's naval base in Syria. The rebel free Syrian army said that they had nothing to do with the attack because they don't have that kind of firepower available. The Israeli government hasn't confirmed or commented on the issue either. But if these U.S. claims turn out to be true, that would mark the fourth Israeli airstrike in Syria in the past six months. Gadot O'Colman has written extensively about the Syrian conflict and says Israel is trying to help the Syrian rebels who are losing the war against the government. I think that the reason they carried out the attack is because the rebels are losing. I mean, the, the foreign terrorists, the foreign mercenaries, uh, they're losing the, the battle. Uh, the, and Israel is, uh, I think, uh, giving them a helping hand. Um, the last attack, remember, in, uh, in May was against a military training center in Damascus. And that was very, very important because um, the Syrians have had to retrain soldiers since the start of this war uh, in order to be able to deal with um, the new non-conventional warfare techniques being used against them. And so, uh, again, targeting military and scientific training centers is part of Israeli strategy. So I think uh, they're, what they're essentially trying to do is give the uh, rebels a helping hand, because at this stage, they, they lost the war. And um, this is part of, you know, keeping the, keeping the war going and also provoking uh, the, uh, the Assad uh, government.